Okay, so this is a uh, quick demo of the new um, faction that I'm working on. So I have added it to my Steam Apps Common Arma 3 folder. So it's just this folder here. This just contains the add on. And you can't see the PBR that's inside it because it's uh, a PBR. Um, but uh, that's where it goes. You just drop this folder into the uh, Armour 3 um, main area. Select folder, local mods, so it should now be loaded as a local mod. And I think I might have already loaded it actually. So this is the Domino mod list. And there's the Domino Soviet Chinese mod that's now loaded. Okay, so let's play those mods. I'm new to this streaming game, so I'm not sure if it's actually working or not. So just in case, better record some video as well. So I was having some issues with uh, not being able to load um, groups of um, units. I could load individual units that were custom built, but couldn't load any of the groups. But I think I might have worked out what the issue was now. So uh, I'll have a quick look. Drop some units and groups down and see if they're working. Um, in the editor, uh, it doesn't matter where we do, let's do uh, Jungle. Let's try one of these new maps. Why the hell not? Check if the map works as well as the uh, mod. 277 FPS, if only. No, no, that's more like it. Okay, wow, beautiful. Look at that. Uh, let's find a nice area to drop some people down in. Looks good. Wow, it's a beautiful map. Um, okay, so we are looking at uh, TFA, there we are, TFA, Soviet Chinese faction. So we've got a bunch of APCs, some artillery. Uh, it's all modeled on the 80s, uh, maybe early 90s. Um, so nothing really modern at the moment. We can change that if we need to. The images um, of the actual units don't reflect what you actually get. This is what the original uh, units that they were based on look like. Um, the thumbnails don't work. So for instance, an ammo bearer now looks like this. Um, for some reason, he's got some stupid glasses on, which he shouldn't have. Uh, doesn't look very Chinese, but he is actually. If we go into the settings. Uh -huh. Identity, uh, Chinese name, Chinese face, and Chinese voice. So all of the units are Soviet Chinese. So um, there we go, stick an officer down. Stick a, let's see, team leader down. Stick a squad leader down. Okay, so some of these are, I guess, I guess very uh, well tan Chinese, but yeah, Chinese. Right, so the issue I was having was with um, units, so let's try that. Um, so I'll say them again, uh, TFA, Soviet Chinese, infantry, rifle squad, and yeah, it's all, okay, it's working now. So they are all in their uniforms. This is very early doors yet, so it's, um, the weapons are all done. Uh, we can change the uniforms to something a little bit more Chinese looking, but this at the moment is what I've got because it's just um, kind of generic. Uh, as I said, there are no Soviet 
a Chinese badges or weapon or uh, uniforms or anything with uh, Chinese markings on. So we're just going to make it look as Chinesey as possible. So that's what we've got. And then let's go. Our special forces team would be just a fire team and uh, support infantry, heavy weapons support team. Same again, but they are all Chinese. They all have Chinese names, they all have Chinese voices, and they all have um, Soviet style weapons, AKs and RPGs and everything. And yeah, that's about it. The squad all mechanized. Uh, yeah, we can stick down a BD, BRDM team. Uh, there we go. Okay, defy play scenario. Let's see if any of them are talking. This is one of the Northern Fronts maps, so it's supposed to be somewhere in Finland, I believe, so I don't want to tell the Chinese to do it up there. Yeah, very angry little Chinese at the moment. Let's give him someone to play with. Second World War, um, guys. In let's, uh, let's go for troops. It's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be something you've never seen before. Seventies Chinese in Finland fighting. Okay, so all working. It's a day's work, but yeah, it's quite fun.